King David said centuries ago, who am I that the Lord would bring me to this place? When he thought about his life and all the failures of his life, and then he thought about the blessings of the Lord on his life. He said, who am I that the Lord would favor me so much? The psalmist said in Psalm 2, when I consider the work of the Lord's hands, the sun, moon, and the stars, who am I? What is man that he would even visit me? I feel that way too, don't you? But you know why the Lord blesses us? It's not because we have performed properly. It's not because of our morality or of our religiosity. It's not that. It's because of the righteousness of His Son, Jesus. He leads us in the paths of righteousness for His name's sake. It's all because of Christ. Here's an old song, one of my personal favorites, entitled, Who Am I? When I think of how He came so far from glory Came to dwell among the lowly such as I To suffer shame and such disgrace On Mount Calvary take my place then I ask myself this question, Who am I? Who am I that a king would bleed and die for? Who am I that he would pray, Not my will, thine Lord? The answer I may never know Why He ever loved me so And to an old rugged cross He'd go For who am I? When I'm reminded of His words, I'll leave Thee never. Just be true and I'll give to You new life forever. Oh, I wonder what I could have done to deserve God's only Son. To fight my battles until they're won For who am I? Who am I that a king would bleed and die for? Who am I that he would pray Not my will, thine law? The answer I may never know Why He ever loved me so And to an old rugged cross He'd go For who am I? And to an old rugged cross He'd go For who am I?